Hey guys, Nick here. Today we're here with another uh, Mixel review. This review is the uh, Mixel Series 6 Munchos. See, we have Waka Waka, we have Burp, and we have Snacks. So, anyways, now. What we have here is something we are going to do for a little bit of a toy review. I'm sorry. But, uh, yeah. So, the first one we're going to review is Vaka Waka. So, Vaka Waka, he's really cool. Because, uh... Like, you can lift his mouth, and then not only that, if you can see, there's, like, a little hole in, uh, Vaka's mouth. So, if you take, like, one of the little popsicles he comes with, he comes with an orange one and a green one. I like to call them popsicles for some reason, because I feel like they look somewhat close to popsicles. If you can see, it's focusing. But, uh, yeah. I'm gonna... You can see you can put this in the back. And if you can see it's in there, and then if you can see it, you can see it through the back too. Because if you saw the special, the Mixel special, uh, you would see in the trailer. Because that's actually coming out at the time I'm posting this. Um, the Mixel special is gonna come out in about like three hours, maybe. I don't know. So I got these today to celebrate. Yeah, we can put this one in here too because you know, yeah. And you can close it back up for safekeeping and you know, all that. And if you can see Va uh Waka, he actually has different colored teeth. Hello Yeah, he, ha he has like a fan colored tooth. I want type the of one thing. Too. So yeah. Um he has like a different color like sand to him. And uh yeah. Kinda of looks angry though. So yeah. A little bit of a bio about these guys. Um, Waka eats stuff. I mean, Vaka eats stuff, and then Waka handles the food out, input and output, whether he likes it or not. So yeah, uh, that's probably why he has all that tooth decay in there. But uh, yeah, he can like raise his hand and stuff. He's got his feet. Yeah, he's a fairly heavy build. Um, yeah, so I would actually give this like a 10 star because he's really cool. He has like one of the best play features ever. And uh, yeah, he was just a very good build. Um, and uh, yeah. And mixes he's featured in, the mixes he is featured in, they are the Munchos Max and the Waka Waka Forks Mix. Next up, what we have on the chopping block is Burp and the Nixel. Sorry about that. Um, yeah. But yeah, Aiden's acting up. You know what? I'm gonna post this on Because you're being a bad. Aiden's being a bad boy. But yeah. This is what I like a lot. This is like the coolest animation ever. Like, dance. Dance, dance, dance. Dance, dance, dance. Dun, dun, dun. But yeah, he's really cool. He kind of reminds me of Gox because when he does this, like, because he can do this with his arms. There's like a little helicopter. And uh, yeah, it's really cool. And uh, yeah, he's got a little basket in his mouth. I'm not, I'm following this guy called Lobstar Poke Fan. On Instagram, um, he has a YouTube channel called Skylanders Gameplay. You should really go subscribe to him. Uh, yeah, so, um, yeah. 
So, uh, yeah. He's a really cool figure. All in all. He comes with, like, these four little cherries. Which is pretty cool. And they have the Lego elves little basket thingy. But, yeah, he, um, he actually posted a picture on Instagram where he saw this little crate little thingy. And he said, um, I said I'd buy this on eBay. It's, uh, two dollars. Like, it's, uh, two dollars. And then I think he should have. But there's really no sense in doing it now since they're out now. Anyways, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, and the hashtag it was really funny. It was, the only piece I m need to ma is to make a good or at least decent looking burp. Yeah, yeah, it's like, funny. But, uh, yeah. Here comes the two. He comes with two of the uh, green cherries, and he comes with two of the red cherries. And uh, yeah, and he also comes with the Nixel. This is a two eared Nixel. Yeah, this is the last series we're going to see these faces. Like, like in series one through six, we saw these faces like nonstop. But from what I've seen in the next series, Series 7, there's going to be a character called Camelot, and he's going to come with the same kind of Mixel design, but the face is going to have, like, a Mixel kind of, like, smiling with his teeth, like, kind of like that, and he's going to have, like, stars in his eyes. It's going to be a really cool figure, and finally we get some new, like, print on them, so, yeah, that'll be cool. Anyways, yeah, he's a pretty cool build. Um, if you want to add more to your Mixel collection, and he kind of, and, um, before I go, he kind of reminds me of the Cragster's Max. Because of the top of his head, because I remember, like, the, like his eyes weren't, like, lined up. So, yeah, he kind of makes an S on the top, too. Yeah. But, as we know. And, uh, yeah. Now, up until my brother's favorite character in the Snackers. He... Now, my little brother said this is his favorite. It is Snacks. He's one of the tall ones. He's got chubby cheeks. Yep, he's pretty derpy looking in the cartoon. So his, bo his bio is a very wide-eyed kid, so that kind of tells you Mixels have ages, and he's pretty much a kid. And, uh, yeah. But yeah, he looks derpy with all his, like, chubby cheeks and big lips. Go look up a picture, or go subscribe to, um, to, uh, Connor Pizza on Wheels, too. Yeah, he made a second channel, and that's his profile picture. It's the derpy looking, bur it's the derpy looking snacks with a mustache. Yeah, it kind of made me laugh because it looks so derpy. But uh, yeah, he holds like these little cupcakes that you can put in there, but I don't recommend putting them in there because if you could see, they get kind of caught in his cheek. If you could see, like if I put one in here, it can go through his cheek because he's like the hollow one. But, uh, yeah. But, yeah, he can turn his head like that. He's got the little joint in the back. And then he's got, like, the hinge on here. But, yeah, there's really not much to say about this guy. He was a pretty cool build, and it was really fun to build him. So, uh, yeah. And just as a little bonus for you guys, I will show you the packaging art for the Mixels. This is Snacks Bag. They just have, like, a little mix on there. They have the warning occasionally. They would usually have this, like, little, um, the little picture of the Mixel in the cartoon right there, but that got cut off, unfortunately. So, uh, yeah, sadly, that happened. We yeah, have, like, the background that's going to be in the cartoon. We've got the Cupid there, Cartoon Network. And on the back, you have the Munchos Max. I actually did do a separate video on that, but I'm going to post it like, after this one. And, uh, yeah. See, and then you got all of them. You got the Weldos, the Corp Corp, and then the Munchos. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, so, uh, yeah. You can see, so, yeah, these are pretty cool. If you're looking for them, they have the lavender bags. The Glorp Corp, the Glorp Corps have the, um, 
yellow black packaging and then the Glorp Corp has a uh, lime packaging. So yep, thanks for watching this little mixel video. I hope you guys really love this video and if you do can you please subscribe for more mixel videos and just videos in general. And I'll see you guys later. Bye bye.